This is a pump for bicycle suspension or motorcycle suspension. The reason that I got it is there is a no loss valve already installed in it. Why is that important? Because every time you put air into this uh, shock, when you take it out, you lose a lot of PSI. So this valve will allow you to disconnect it without losing any, and that's very important. It's two tools in one. And this is what we have. We have about 125, 150 is right over there. What I need is 150 in here. So what you want to do with this gauge is, is put it to the, to the pressure that you want. That's the pressure that's going to stay because this is a no loss valve. So a lot of people get this one wrong because when they check the second time, they're like, why is it um, 150? That means that every time I take it out, I lose some. No, you don't because when you disconnect it, the air that you hear going through it, it's the air that is on the hose itself, not from the shock. So this valve, as soon as you start depressing it, it's already this, uh, uh, locked, the valve is already locked in. So when you unscrew this uh, connector, it's, it's already keeping the pressure inside. So that, that uh, hissing noise that you hear, that is from the hose itself. Uh, pretty good pump, uh, I like it. It's serviceable, so you could disconnect it from here and then you could uh, service it. There it is, so this is the, the tip and it can easily be serviced, uh, greased, uh, put back in. Uh, has pretty decent pressure, so it could go pretty easy, it goes to 200 PSI. I highly doubt you're gonna have to do more, but it can go up to 300 on the gauge, so it says 300. And it has a quick release over here. Now this one, when you push it, if you have a small uh, chamber like the bicycle does, all the air goes out like almost instantly. So then all you have to do is just reinflate it. So if you go over it, and then you're thinking that, oh, I went 200, I want to go to 150, you push this button, basically goes almost all the way to the end. Uh, it's, it's a quick release. So what you have to do is just push this button and then reinflate it and make sure you don't go over it and then you're fine. So pretty good pump. I really, really like it. And uh, pretty nice and durable and then it just folds into itself and uh, you're ready to go. Thanks for watching.